Like my kids always come first. I I be forgetting that I got a chronic illness and everything because I have a hard time with you know what I'm saying. I don't I don't want to see my kids unhappy, you know. And so I talk to them, I play with them. Like we still wrestle around the house, dance, we do the lip scene battle thing. Like yeah, we still entertain. We dress up. My so, children got a dress up being. Yeah, I think that I'm saying <laughs> pride could have like a lot to do with that too, as far as like if you have like a single parent or whatever mm-hmm. going through stuff and it's just they so used to how people on Facebook just talk about anybody that's asking for anything that might be reaching out until they got to the point where they don't actually they're afraid to ask for help or whatever because yeah. they're so scared of what their friends gonna think about them yeah. or say about them yeah so you know what I'm saying like I mean cause cause I'm on Facebook pretending like you got it going on and in reality you really don't you need the help mm-hmm. I'm a single mother mm-hmm. I've never been married mm-hmm. I raised four two boys and they grown men and two girls. Mm-hmm. You understand what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I've never been too proud to ask for the help. If you quit, get your butt off Facebook. Shut your Facebook page down. Let's be mamas. It's time for us to come on and be mamas. But, Titi, I'm going to be honest with you. Like, pride would get in my way as well because, like, when people do stuff for you, they like to throw it in your face. You know what I'm saying? That. And they, they be like, well, I did this for you and I did that for you because I ain't going to lie. People always feel like a lot of people that they got a lot of kids get a lot of food stamps. We got five kids in the house and all we get is a hundred and fifty dollar worth of food stamps. Y'all that ain't nothing. And it's it's but I'm just saying it's seven it's seven people in the house. Yeah. That's like Children eat like grown people. Yes, you know what do. I'm saying? So it's like we still struggle. You know, they, they feel like, oh, them, they be getting government, government assistance. All people with a lot of kids don't be getting government assistance. Y'all, half of the time, y'all don't even be knowing what they ta- what y'all talking about. You see what I'm saying? But, you know, I, I'd rather make do <laughs> and hustle and feed my kids before I ask this person over here. You don't suppose that- to go and ask everybody. Mm-hmm. That's where it comes back to. Mm-hmm. You feel it. The spirit of that person. But see, like, what if, what if they go to somebody they thought they could, and that's who burned them? Then mm-hmm. What I'm going to say is, my up. name is Tracy Gibbs, and I'm on Facebook all the time. I may not have a lot of money, but, babe, I promise you, if you come in my inbox and you need anything and I got it, nobody else will hear it. That's why we call that's it That's where mama. it begins. Right. Somebody got to step up and open their mouth. Um, always at home. If you're trying to work, and I know you're working, and you need a babysitter, I'm not going to ask you for a dime. But your behind better be working. Hello. You better be working. Well, Titi, I need a babysitter. No, you don't. Y'all don't need no babysitter. But my babies can come to the house. I they can go come. on the avenue tonight. I'm serious. <laughs> That's what know. we're talking about. Mm-hmm. Somebody got to start somewhere. So guess what? My inbox is open. My Facebook is open. I don't care what it is. I'm not going to tell nobody what we talk about. That's between God and me but see it's a lot of people that you know what I'm saying like my mama ain't keep my kids if I wasn't working and you know I used to be upset you know but then as I as I grew old I was like my mama ain't my mama ain't lay with me to make these kids so it wasn't her priority to keep my kids and I feel like she made me the woman that I am you see what I'm saying because it's a lot of people they mama be having their children that's why I won't be knowing they have kids because everybody be having their kids you see what I'm saying and they be what they be doing Mario at the club doing this doing that you know and I just be reading these young young females on um, pose and I just be like, man, they need to sit their little young ass down. You know, and you always want to say I was young when I was twenty four. I had two kids and pre- and pregnant with my third kid. I always took care of my kids. I ain't had no fucking babysitter. My mama wasn't playing it. My grandma wasn't playing it. Dudes that stand in these halls with these women, they letting them women be messy. Cause if you mind, I see you on Facebook and you doing some old crazy junk. I'm gonna tell you quick, hey man, cut that shit up. Yeah, no, that's the next point I was finna get you. You know what I'm saying? But that's that's crazy. Like you see your woman that got some junk going on. Like man, look, put that phone on. Get off that shit. Like quick, you know what I'm saying, folks. But you ain't too many men gonna stand up and do that because mm-hmm. that ain't their house and they ain't really paying no bills. So and they, they don't care. And they live rent free and yeah. they don't have a job and they can still eat good. They'll be the ones that and, the mama uh, buy the steaks for with the food stamps. Mm-hmm. While we talking about the food stamps, anybody got some food stamps? I, <laughs> <laughs> I will pick your card up and your code and I'll bring it back to you. And I, I, come back. I won't spend no more than a hundred dollars on that. <laughs> and I'll bring some apple sandals back. <laughs> oh. 
No, because I was just basically pointing at you because she, she don't indulge in, like, mess or drum. No. You know what I'm saying? And, like, if, if I got some tea, I got to sneak and be like, girl, here come Sean. I call you back. Because she don't be wanting to hear that. You know what I'm saying? She be like, why are you getting upset over there? Like, why are you even talking about that? Like, that's what type of old lady I got. Yo, that good. I, I, I salute you. Because she be like, calm your nerve, man. She be like, hang up that phone. Because sometimes y'all get so upset about something like... Yeah, we, we Like do. somebody can know what I'm saying, be pissing me off. Get what that person ain't doing nothing to mm-hmm. uh, elevate yo 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 right. you know what I'm saying, your life. So get what it right. is. You elevate my life. Fuck you. Mm-hmm. Your thoughts or whatever else you got going on. I ain't gonna get on Facebook. Man, you make me so motherfucking sick. I'm sick of you. I'm sick of your bitch. I'm sick of all these other motherfuckers deal with you. Yeah. And okay. guess what? That time you made that post, you could have been doing something productive. Thank you. I could have been thinking a way to make a dollar fifty cent turn to five dollars. Mm-hmm. And then if I can do that a hundred times, then look how much I done made. Mm-hmm. You're right. Mm-hmm. You say like, man, I ain't got time for all that. But you remember, we are emotional creatures. I know. But get what? That way you I mean, need that, that unemotional creature to tell you, hey, look, you know, entertain that shit. Salute. <laughs> She give me that look, I be like, see, I yeah, got a bitch. You, know, you, you got some of these hard headed women, get what? If I just say if if I'm married or if I'm in a relationship where I pay the phone bills, we're on the same plan. You got your ass up there on that Facebook being missing shit. <laughs> Next month your bill won't be paid. So you're gonna get the Wi Fi disconnected. Be like, my no, wife ain't working. You work. might got 4G. Oh. <laughs> so I'm gonna just let your whole phone get cut off. You can get only incoming calls this month. <laughs> <laughs> But did anybody have anything to say or they just basically was listening? They've been saying a lot. What they been oh, saying? Oh my God, oh, we I mean, missed we've it. We've been talking and talking. They've been saying a lot. I've been trying to get your attention. Oh. <laughs> but, you know, your, your spirit and your body was moving. Yeah, so your spirit like, moved. I'm, can't so, stop I'm so sorry, you guys. Inbox me, ask me, whatever you want. I'm yeah. sorry. Well, I just what it, did you want to know? I mean, because a lot of people was inboxing me like, what's wrong? It's nothing wrong. Like, it's, it's just time. Like, some people just want to speak on stuff that's real. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And, it, it, like, I, I just was uneasy about a lot of things that go on around me. You know what I'm saying? How can somebody see that a child has been killed on the news and don't feel no certain type of way? Like, my baby just turned 13. She was just 12. So, yes, I feel some type of way. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of people are like, what's wrong? Well, you, you, like, nothing has to be wrong. You know, some people yeah, need right. to speak on it. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all always want to be tuned in when we're talking about freaky shit. But when we're talking about serious stuff, 10, 9, 11, y'all got to get it together. Yeah. Oh, you raising your hand? Oh, no. No, I, <laughs> I thought she was raising. They, they stay tuned for a good little while. They mm-hmm. do. Oh, okay. Don't worry, y'all. I'm going to have y'all some freaking messy shit. Ooh, yes. See? Look. The viewers went right there. Right back up. 36, just that face. It's so silly. The thing of it is, it's time to be just stepped on a lot of people's toes, and they mm-hmm. just don't want to face a lot of people face the facts. Mm-hmm. They don't want to face it. But sometimes so, people need to hear that, though. And mm-hmm. they do. And I want, I'm one of the ones that be glad to tell them, and I don't care how they feel about it. What are they going to do? Because you don't know why Leah, first of all, and I dare you not to come where I, I say. You, you might make her get off Facebook. You know? Oh, that's good. They need to get out funny. Where your baby's at? They got hunting when they out of school. Well, go do something with them. Go cook. Mm-hmm. Let's let's get get the Bible. Teach them how to pray. Mm-hmm. Teach them how to count. Let's do that. Mm-hmm. I don't care. You mad? Oh, oh we hell. got flashcards. We still have those. <laughs> Well, I had to get them when I first went back to culinary school. Like, it was a shock. I was like, what the fuck? And they still sell. I didn't even really use these. And they still sell. The school, no, and, they, and they still sell the books with the lines of the people. That's oh, why I know. Baby, they keep yeah. Yeah. Well, I, I got, got that mirror thing. I was so blown when I went back to school. Uh-huh. So that's why it was like I made a challenge to my turn. Like, mm-hmm. well, y'all got to make good grades. If I got to sit in this motherfucker, <laughs> right out like, we would come home, man. We would have like seven days worth of homework from Ooh. Monday. And every day they add some more on. Throughout the whole week, so the next Monday, all this got to be turned in. So it's like yep. the cooking wasn't really shit. Mm-hmm. The homework was the motherfucker yeah. that, that yeah. work, but get what you need that knowledge so you know mm-hmm. how to solve little problems in the kitchen or whatever. That's right. And I ain't gonna lie, <laughs> boy, I, I take my hat off to any woman that's a single mama. You raising children, you got to cook, you got to clean, you got to wash some clothes, mm. and you can go to school. Mm. But that's a hard working woman. When I was in CNA school, I had that baby on that titty. I was doing that homework and everything. That's why I be like, man, I don't play, man. I went through so much trying to have y'all and raise y'all. I'm not fit. Ain't no the devil can't have you, man. You I went, I went through so much stuff. I you almost died what? for you, boy. You think I'm finna let the devil take you? No, <laughs> I'm fighting for mine. That's what I be telling Satan. I'm fighting for mine. You got me messed up. <laughs> you know, you got a lot of parents scared to whoop because they scared of these folks gonna do and they gonna get in your business. Now they, now that, now I ain't gonna lie. 
Because <laughs> they will come to your house well, and add the food. Let me what just happened with me. No, no lie. No. Y'all think I'm lying? I got witnesses all outside. So I put I put my phone on speakerphone in a minute. Lady called me talking about she was uh, with DHR and she needed to speak to my son. And could I bring my son? Man, let me tell you something. I don't owe the court system shit. Mm-hmm. I'm off parole. I don't owe, you know what I'm saying? No explanation. No, mm-hmm. I said... DHR don't give me no motherfucking food stuff. Mm-hmm. Don't give me no nothing. I said, get what y'all can do. Y'all can tell me what I need to do to uh, get off child support for my child that live with me. <laughs> okay, okay, then. Why okay, then. Out, you know what I'm he live here. I don't get no food stuff. Y'all ain't give me a goddamn thing. Okay, so then. How y'all gonna try to tell me what to do? I said, get what? I ain't got nothing to say to y'all. His mama is his legal guardian. He lives with me. So she's like, well, how did that happen? I said, well, you called me. You supposed to be able to tell me. You know what I'm saying? She's like, oh, yeah, well, the mama... Told me, you know what I'm saying? She uh, mm-hmm. had it where well, he had to come back and stay with oh, you. Okay, so get what if he got to stay with me? Whatever the fuck you talking about, you got to talk about, <laughs> talk to his mama. Okay, then. Get some assistance from y'all, but y'all don't give me a goddamn thing, and I ain't got to say shit to you. Okay, I'll leave in a few hours. <laughs> <laughs> you talk them right, though. Cause Cause it, what, I don't owe y'all shit. Y'all don't right. give me no assistance. I don't have to sit up and talk to you about shit. And I know another parent, another father that's like him, the baby stay with him, with him. But and the mother's he, getting the help. Yes. Yeah. And I just be like, you know, I be I be telling yeah, these. Now you when you try to go down there and get off of it. Yeah, because I was talking to him because I was like, you know, y'all father fail to realize y'all have rights as well. Yeah. Like, like I would even help a guy if I know that you're doing right. Look, you need to go down here and do this proper paperwork. Get them this proper amount of money, blah 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 blah. Like I'm not because I'm a lesbian. Choose to live this lifestyle don't mean I hate men. Correct. You know what I'm saying? That's what I have to tell a lot of guys all the time. If you're respectful, I'm gonna respect you to the fullest. You gonna be my brother. You see what I'm saying? But a lot of men don't know that they have rights and they ain't gotta sit up here and take that shit. You know what I'm saying? You go down here because half of the time these people going off of what this mama is saying. They really don't know the situation for real. And if you sitting at home just complaining to your homeboys, your family members about it, they don't know what the hell going on. You better go down there and tell on her ass like she told on you. But boy, let me tell you something though. I ain't gonna lie. That five old what is that? No, the Bay Hayes building. That's a hell of a building. So I went down there with the bullshit a couple of times because I just don't be caring. And the little man was telling me about uh, what I had. No, the, it was a referee lady mm-hmm. first. Come to find out, she the cool one. But uh, I hadn't told her, you know what I'm saying? Like, man, you a referee. I ain't come here to play no games. I ain't listening to you. Mm-hmm. But on my left, I come back next time. It's jo- uh, George Brown. Mm-hmm. Man, that man, now let me tell you, he don't give a fuck what you done been doing. Like, he just against. He's so old. You, you know what I'm saying? As a man. So I had just let brother know, like, get yeah, what? I don't give a fuck what you do. Like, if my child live with me and I'm taking care of him, mm-hmm. I'm not finna send no money to nobody for free. Mm-hmm. Like, Myron told me that. Mm-hmm. Myron told me, don't pay nobody no motherfucking child support and you got that child. Mm-hmm. He Which said, is just, right. He told me, that, you know what I'm saying, just get saved and don't pay it. Mm-hmm. Ain't that what you said, Myron? <laughs> <laughs> Look at <up. laughs> <laughs> Well, you guys, we hope that you guys enjoyed this serious topic. What we need y'all to do is share, share, share. Somebody you might know need to hear with the things that we was saying. So, guess what? You can share it and put it in their inbox. Yeah. Do that. Um, TT, Tracy Gibbs, she said you could jump in her inbox. You know, and you guys, it is people out here that really care and that will really help. Um, you want, you know, a closed mouth ain't finna get fed. So if you Close just down. sitting at home and really not saying that, then how do people supposed to know? So instead of talking about the next person, you guys, let's uplift. That's why, you know, I do a lot of, like, mo- motivational stuff because, you know, I be needing it myself. You know, because it's hard being a mother in 2017. Like, I've really caused myself to have anxiety. Every time my phone rings, my heart is being like, fast. Because I don't want to ever get that phone call. I see too many kids dying, and I just, I don't want to be one of those mothers. Like, it's just terrifying to me. So, um, you guys, yep, you right, TT. Um, see you guys later, and, you know, we'll see y'all next week with the mess and drama that y'all want to hear. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> Good night.
Seems like yesterday we used to rock the show. I laced the track, you locked the flow. So far from hanging on the block for dough. Notorious, they got to know that life ain't always what it seemed to be. Words can't express what you mean to me, even though you're gone. 